So you might be trying to figure out what every single reset option means inside of your iPhone. Now, this is a very, very basic thing. So if you make your way over to your settings application of your iPhone, if you click on general, and if you go and scroll down until you see transfer or reset iPhone, you will see a few things. Now, if you go ahead and zoom in, these things can mean a little bit of a different thing per person. So what I'm going to go ahead and you know, show you first is this reset button. So what you're going to want to do is if you click reset, you'll see a few of these different options. You'll see a reset all settings. This basically means that all your settings within your iPhone are basically going to be reset. So this specific one right here is, you know, just the settings within your iPhone. This includes like Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, different you know, devices connected via those things. This will basically reset all settings back to factory, you know, default. It's not going to delete everything from your phone, but it could reset some things that are connected to those other devices. So keep that in mind. Now, reset network setting basically means that your Wi-Fi connections and everything will basically be reset. So this also includes things like Bluetooth connections and all those things as well. So that's basically going to reset that particular option. A quick, you know, turnaround, a quick like FYI, this reset all settings will also reset every single one of these options as well. So keep that in mind. If you reset this one, it's going to reset all these. Reset keyboard dictionary, very easy to understand. This one just, you know, refreshes and resets your keyboard. So all your words that you've added, anything new that you did with your keyboard, it's going to basically reset it. So any autocorrect words, everything, those are going to be reset as well. Reset home screen layout. This is also another one that's pretty easy to understand. If you go and reset that, all your you know phone apps and everything like that, your home screen will basically be reset back to factory default. But that isn't that big of a deal. Nothing's necessarily going to be deleted, but it can basically go through and essentially, you know, reset your phone in terms of the home screen to kind of make it look like a brand new device. I don't know why you'd want to do it, but you can do that if you want to. And reset location and privacy. All those, you know, areas that you've been to that your phone saved, any you know, things that are saved on your phone via location and privacy are also going to be deleted. So these are pretty basic to understand, to be honest. This last one where it's erase all content and settings, Within this one, it will basically show you everything that will be deleted from your phone. It's a lot of stuff, so I wouldn't recommend anyone to do it unless you know what you're doing. But this one, like I said, is the granddaddy of all of them. It will basically go through and delete everything from your device. So that pretty much covers it up. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.